What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Luna Figs. About to head inside Walmart, see if I can't find some toys. Prepare for launch. <laughs> Well, it looks like we got some stocking stuffers out. Let's check those out. Got some little mini-verse. Make it mini-lifestyle. Uh, some sort of donut or something. Got some Hot Wheels multi-packs. Monster Jams. Got the Lord of the Rings mini-verse. All kinds of miniverse stuff. <laughs> A lot of hot wheels too. Got some little hug me's. Not familiar with these. The little plush things. I guess these are the squishmallows of the year. Oh, they're from squishmallows. <laughs> there you go. Oh, got a little stitch down there. Got Transformers. Got the Simpsons. <laughs> Oh, I just got fart ninja. <laughs> uh, let's see, you got some Melissa and Doug and Fisher Price stuff. Got some games and puzzles. And then we got some Lego sets down here. Got Minecraft, there's Santa and his sleigh, Unicorn, a dragon, some gingerbread people. And a little bulldozer. Oh, and Rex. And it's the $9.97 price. So it's even marked down a little bit. So that's really cool. These were hard to find at first. <laughs> so kind of surprising those are a stocking stuffer special this year. All right, let's uh, go see what else we can find. Over in the toy section now, we got lots of Pokemon. <laughs> All kinds of cards and figures. Metallic? I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Well, that's pretty cool. Got some rainbow friends, pudgy penguins, bendy. Oh, let's see, got some Bandai figures down here. Stumble guys. And a whole big bunch of nope. <laughs> Let's keep going. All right, got more Simpsons right here, but first we got little Christmas Nerf pistols. <laughs> a little wreath on the front, that's kind of fun. More little stocking stuffer type things. We do have Ned and Homer. There's Chief Wickham again. And we have the bigger figures. And we have the Hydropods, which I'm hearing are actually pretty cool. So that's neat. Got Marvel ones and it's just generic ones as well. We've got Duke over here. Let's stick him back on the pig. Got some Masterverse and Turtles of Grey Skull. There's Ram Man up there. Uh, both the Turtles of Grey Skull and the Cartoon Collection version. And there's Web Store. Let's see if they're down here as well. Not just Evil End down here. Oh, there's. Hordak from Turtles of Grey Skull. There's Ram Man. So yeah, pretty cool stuff there. Got a whole bunch of retro carded Dukes. Got some wrestlers over here. Rob Van Dam, Stevie Ray. There's the Mean Gene and Hulk two pack. Got Triple H down here. Matt Jackson. Nick Jackson. There's Saranya. Malachi Black. So yeah, I got some cool wrestling. Tony D'Angelo. Uh, I got Star Wars over here. Black Series. Looks like it's the usual suspects. I always have to have a Lando. Lots of Raiders and Mandos. Vintage collection. Pretty decent. So yeah, Star Wars is looking nice. Got a bunch of TIE Interceptors down here. 
ATT. Well, there's the Phantom. I've seen where people are finding the Phantom 2, so I'll keep an eye out for that. Do got superpowers. There's the Green Lantern, Superman, Batman. Let's see, there's Jake Garrett down here. There's the Clooney Batman. And we got not a lot of dinosaurs. Like, very few dinosaurs. <laughs> Legends, not much going on there. A lot of Ollie's fodder. Ninja Turtles. Got a lot of Genghis Frog. <laughs> and then some Mutant Mayhem. A whole bunch of Baxters as well. And then got some Transformers down here. But there you go. Let's uh, move on. Checking out diecast now. Look at the Hot Wheels. Got some pretty neat looking stuff. Yeah, not bad at all. Decently stocked. We got this little display here as well. In the bucket down there. <laughs> oh, got the super rigs. Oh yeah, see, okay, two different versions of this. There's that green one. Then we have the silver one. It's a turbulence tug. Yeah, they're both turbulence tugs. So is one a chase or something, or just a different paint job? Let me know. <laughs> Got Racer Verse. There's Marty McFly. Starting to see him a little more often now. Do know there is a chase of him in the hazmat suit. But don't see them here. Got some matchbox. And some monster trucks. There's the Batmobile tumbler. Yeah, let's see. A lot of Fast and Furious. Ooh, focus. <laughs> Not sure what happened there. Maybe it was just my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all kinds of Fast and Furious. Got Ferris Bueller, NCIS, County Cars. Got some motorcycles over here. And we got some haulers, some F1. Lots of Fast and Furious and some big time muscle. Oh, that's pretty cool. Jazz. All right, well, I think that is it for diecast. Taking a look at Lego, we've got botanicals. There's a Tankle Garden. Got some few Star Wars sets. I was trying really hard to find the Star Wars Advent Calendar, but they have disappeared. Uh, I know they had all of them on sale for 20 bucks for Black Friday. All the different Lego Advent Calendars. And they are pretty much all gone. And the Star Wars ones, they dried up before <laughs> Black Friday even hit. Uh, we do have the Onyx Cinder that has premiered. Really enjoying Skeleton Crew. First two episodes came out the other day. So uh, let me know if you've checked it out, what you think. I really liked it. Uh, there's Jedi Bob, Obi-Wan Starfighter. There's the Hogwarts. They just uh, announced Diagon Alley in this scale, which looks really cool. So uh, I have a feeling my wife will be picking that one up. <laughs> Lots of Disney. Uh, there was a really good deal 
on that for Black Friday. I believe Target had it, but it sold out like instantly. <laughs> but it was like $28 for that up house. You got the piranha plant. It's down to $47.95, so that's a good deal. But yeah, they've announced a lot of new sets coming out January 1st. So just a few weeks away, and we'll have some more new Lego to look at. But that is it for this Lego section. Well, I spoke too soon. <laughs> got a little bit more over here. Well, all right, that's it now. Over in the collector section, checking things out. We've got a Miles Morales statue there. There's Gizmo peeking in behind some books. There's Ted Lasso. Got the biker mice. We've got a carded scarlet up here. Yeah, there's Elvira. Oh man, look at all the first sketch turtles. <laughs> there's those Feratu cartoon, cartoony terror, that is. There's Beetlejuice. Call of Duty Spawn, SH Figure Arts, got Sectars, there's a couple of Tatsus, and Sinja Patrol Bot. So a lot of NECA stuff. Got Dragon Ball, Demon Slayer, Bleach, Nobara, I don't know, that's Jujutsu Kaisen. Yeah, don't know that one. <laughs> one Piece over here. Got the War of the Rohirrim. That's coming to Amazon pretty soon. Those are pretty cool. Got some Pops up here, Demon Slayer. There's Paz. Boba Fett, Batgirl. Uh, can I please have Coach Jessica call me and Coach Jessica call me at 105. Thank you. And we got some more pops on the end cap. All right. That is it for the collector section. And that is it for this Walmart toy hunt. Hope you enjoyed it. We kick things off checking out some stocking stuffers pretty cool stuff over there a lot of miniverse and hot wheels uh, that seemed to be the big thing this year also had some uh, cool lego sets cool to see that rex over there on sale and it's a stocking stuffer <laughs> those were very hard to find when they first came out earlier this year so it was good to see those in abundance this time of year uh, we headed back to the main toy aisle checked out the stuff back there a lot of pokemon that kind of stuff. Uh, action figures looking good. A lot of Motu. Wrestling looked good. Uh, I think there was some new stuff back there. At least I think it was new. <laughs> Let me know. I don't know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Star Wars. Well stocked. Nothing new. But uh, a lot of variety. I also have a lot of the Vaders <laughs> and the uh, Paz and Mandos kind of clogging the pegs. So. Hopefully those will go on clearance soon. Uh, make room for some new stuff. Uh, did pick up Brutus. I uh, don't know if you saw my last, last live stream, but I should, did show off Brutus from uh, the Skeleton Crew. Really great figure. Uh, probably going to be picking up some more of <laughs> the Skeleton Crew figures. I'm really liking the show so far. So I think I will be all in on that series. So yeah, excited to find those again and uh, pick some of those up. So I'll be keeping it out for Skeleton Crew Black Series figures. Uh, Marvel Legends, nothing going on. DC Multiverse, eh, some stuff, nothing crazy, no Platinums or anything like that. Uh, Lego, pretty well stocked, uh, especially for this close to Christmas. I uh, know I went to Target the other day and they were wiped out. So <laughs> good to see that they still have stuff on the shelves, even have some good deals that you can pick up. Uh, Diecast was looking good. Saw those two different super rigs. Uh, Hot Wheels people, let me know. Were those one of those a chase or is that just like a different color variant that's uh, just normal? Because I have seen both of those around and I've seen them multiple times. So I don't think any of them's like a treasure hunt or anything like that. I don't even know if they do treasure hunts <laughs> in the super rigs. But, anyways, two different versions of the same Hot Wheels super rig. <laughs> 
Uh, then we went over to the collector section, a lot of NECA over there. Uh, some pops look pretty cool. Uh, one very loud employee <laughs> talking on the intercom. I uh, don't know if y'all heard that or not, but uh, dude, they amplify your voice. You don't have to yell. <laughs> anyway, so I got a little distracted during that part. Sorry about that. Uh, but yeah, that wrapped it up. Uh, did come out empty handed. So I didn't pick up anything today. Uh, let me know in the comments if there was anything you saw that interested you or uh, if you've picked up anything cool yourself lately. Love hearing what you guys are into. But uh, that is all I have for today. If you are new here, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notifications. And I will see you guys next time around.